Welcome everyone back to a brand new video up on the channel again guys some more Clash of Clans content coming right at you Today I wanted to basically get done with a couple of things We're gonna be working on actually saving up enough gold to upgrade our town hall. That's right guys We're a town hall 11 at the moment, but we barely have any stuff left to upgrade here. We have the archer tower, which of course we will work on. We have the gold mines, there's only six of them. Our barbarian king and archer queen I don't really care about because they're going to be dark elixir. They're completely separate from the rest and it's mostly a small cannon that needs to get upgraded and wall segments. That's about it guys. And I'm really, really excited honestly to be a town hall 12. What are we going to be unlocking with the town hall 12? Uh-oh, uh-oh, we can't even check. We can't even check, but we can actually go into the shop really quick. Let's see what's going on in here. Let me move this out of the way really quick, guys, and see what is Town Hall 12 required. I'm pretty sure that with Town Hall 12, oh, we won't be unlocking the scatter shot. I was really, really excited, actually, to hopefully unlock the scatter shot, but it doesn't look like we will be getting that with Town Hall 12. That is a Town Hall 13 exclusive. So, overall though, I am pretty excited because I'm, I know we're gonna be getting some more stuff with a Town Hall 12 upgrade, but we do need to put down some more walls. As well, guys, I'm going to be working on trying to complete some of these um, challenges, basically. I really, really want to get all the rewards for this month. So we uh, just got the power potion. I don't really need that, though. We're going to be getting a thousand builder elixir, hero potion, super potion, resource potion, 15,000 dark elixir, 1,500 elixir, 1,500 gold, and the book of heroes. Now, I always use the book of heroes whenever I do get it because I always leave one saved. As you guys can see right here. Oh, that's a book of building. Sorry. Hmm, where is the... There it is, Book of Heroes. Full of heroic tales and sound advice, this magical book can be used to instantly finish any hero or pet upgrade timer. So I don't yet have any pets, but I know that once you get to a certain town hall, um, you're, you're pretty much able to get pets, and that's really the goal for me, is I really, really want to get pets for my, my characters. But guys, since we are about to get the star bonus for the day, we might as well hop into an attack here. I do want to do at least one attack for a multiplayer battle, one attack for a versus battle, because I really do want to always get these every single day. These daily challenges do really help. So guys, let's hop into a match, and I'll tell you when I'm there. And we found a base to attack, and wow guys, look at this freaking loot. Oh my goodness. Now I love using the baby dragons because their rage ability is just so useful when you separate the units far enough away from each other. They just do so much damage and they really can easily get you 50 star, uh, 50 percent on virtually any base. So I'm, I'm so far I've only used um, I believe 18 troops and we're literally coming up on 50 percent already with troops left over. Now we will have already gotten 500 or 550,000 loot basically of each. Look at that guys, so close to getting the 50%. All we need to do, and this is all I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna actually put down my archer queen. I'm gonna wait and then use her ability right now so that the uh, none of this will actually lock on. Boom, 50% before she takes any damage. Look at that. 600,000 gold and 550,000 elixir. Pretty good, guys. Pretty darn good, if I do say so myself. So we did, of course, get this, but we also got the 1 million builder elixir. Now we're going to hop over to our builder base really quick, collect the elixir, collect the gold, and while we're at it, we're also going to use our free daily boost. Um, let's see what we got going here. So we are currently working on upgrading our baby dragons in this and as you guys can see I do use baby dragons and minions and guys this is a great troop setup if you have very very high level troops and I'll show you why because when you put the baby dragons in by themselves they do have their rage ability and then you can kind of just spam minions behind them and that in and of itself does a crazy number on virtually every base I've 
ever gone after. I truly love it. It's a great class setup, and we're gonna see just how well they can do on this base. Um, so I did go right there strategically because I noticed that they were very, very low walls, but there's really no going about this one. We just gotta get into that center area. Now, they're gonna go for the town hall. Thankfully, they're going to get it, and we're gonna probably get easily 60% on this base, if not more. I'm hoping to get 80%, but I doubt that's gonna happen because this crusher right here does way too much damage, and yep, my Barbarian King or not Barbarian King, but my builder is Dunzo. Oh boy. Come on, get the Tesla. Can we get 60? Can we get 80% I mean? Ah, shoot. Not looking good, guys. No, 78%. 78%, but we did get the two star, so there is a chance that this guy might not be able to actually beat us. Let's go see how well he's doing. If he's got a, like, Oh, 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 oh. Well, it does look like we're gonna win this battle pretty easily, actually. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. Now we're gonna hop over here as well into this. Claim our 1 million builder elixir. We're working at getting new troops, and we're also working at getting our troops upgraded completely. My goal is to fully upgrade this troop, the minion, and to also upgrade the baby dragon completely. If I can get both of these upgraded, I'm sure I can do even better in games against other players. But while we're here, we're also going to upgrade the Spring Trap for 300,000. That's a 12 hour upgrade. So we'll leave that to happen overnight. And when I come back to you guys tomorrow, we're going to have that finished. Now, oh shoot, did I forget to? Well guys, it looks like I forgot to train troops last night, but that's okay. We're going to go and attack with what we have. So we only have 15 troops, 15 baby dragons, but we're going to go and attack with those. Let's hop into a match. Alrighty guys, here is another great loot base, 599,000 elixir, 630,000 gold, and of course if we can get at least one star on the map, then we will also get the bonus loot. I'm going to pop a couple troops around the map. I'm really hoping to be able to get the 50%. I'm going to save two baby dragons to see where they're going to be needed. And I'm also going to save my archer queen and king. My barbarian king, of course, not the archer king. Uh, but we're going to see what we can do here. Maybe we can get the 50%, maybe not. I kind of doubt it, honestly. But 15 baby dragons. Let's see what they can do. Oh boy, they're struggling. They're struggling a bit. Uh, I'm not gonna waste the rest, but that's okay. We don't need it. No, nah, he's going after the Barbarian King. That's okay, guys. We're just gonna end it right there. Getting us a pretty good amount of loot. A million loot total. And, guys, that is honestly not bad. So, the next upgrade that is going to be happening is, of course, the gold mine is going to finish within a next day. And I could, of course, finish it now, guys, but I'm not going to... So we're just gonna let it sit overnight. We're gonna let it finish upgrading. I also do want to try and complete this ninth Clash Aversary challenge, which I have not yet completed. It's just so difficult, guys. It's so difficult, I have not been able to do it. So hopefully I'm able to do it in a video, but of course, as of right now, I have not been able to do it, have not completed it, and that's okay. But as always, I love you guys so much. There's so much coming with the videos and with the channel. Guys, hopefully I can make a daily thing out of this. I really, really do love Clash of Clans content, and I'm getting back into it, of course. So, I hope you guys enjoy it just as much as I do. As always, stay safe, stay cool, guys. I love you all. Have a good one. Peace.